increasing a rust isolate. So now I'm going to talk about increasing rust. So often initial cultures of rust do not contain enough spores to screen the whole differential set right away. And so what we at the Serial Disease Lab do is we inoculate cultures onto a differential set and also a susceptible line. So for example, I'd like to show this tray that has six pots. Five of the pots contain the 20 North American stem rust differentials. But the sixth pot contains just a susceptible line. The seeds planted in this line are seeds of McNair or Line E, which are susceptible to stem rust. When we inoculate the entire tray, we can take the five pots and use those five pots to screen the differentials. The sixth pot is placed into an isolation cubicle and then after the rust has increased on this susceptible line, we can collect the rust for further analysis at a later time. Sometimes a collection of rust contains a mixture of different species, such as leaf rust and stem rust. What we do to isolate just the stem rust from this collection is to increase the rust on a line that is susceptible to stem rust, but universally resistant to leaf rust. What we use is triticale line T2700. And so this line is susceptible to stem rust, but resistant to all known races of leaf rust. Increasing on this line will allow us to isolate just the stem rust from a mixture of leaf rust and stem rust.